Hi, boys and girls. Welcome back. I missed you. This is a fun story. It's called Rube Goldberg's Simple Normal Humdrum School Day. Before we start, we're going, I'm going to tell you the joke. What did the pencil say to the sharpener? Think about it. We're going to read this book. Looks really fun. Let's go. Rube Goldberg's Simple Normal Humdrum School Day by Jennifer George. Illustrated by Ed Stickley. Okay. This looks like a fun book. It's an early on a, it's an early on an ordinary morning down an ordinary street in an ordinary house. And just for a few more minutes in the Goldberg house home, all is quiet. Rube is asleep. But as soon as the sun rises and shines through his bedroom window, you'll see that Rube is no ordinary boy. He's an inventor, a tinker, and he builds epic contraptions. For Rube, up is down, in is out, and no is yes. Maybe he likes doing things the hard way because it's more fun, or maybe because he sees the world a little differently than the most of us. But you can decide for yourself. Here's how Rube Goldberg begins this particular, simple, normal, humdrum school day. I like the pictures. Rube Goldberg's simple way to wake up in the morning. Sunlight, A, shines through his bedroom window and bounces off mirror. B, drying yesterday's bath towel. C, towel dries and gets lighter, causing scale. D, to tip down, lowering on the boxing glove. E, which turns on the power switch. F, starting the model, model train. G, train chugs uphill and launches off pile of books, loading on the power button of the vacuum cleaner. H, vacuum sucks up crumpled paper. I, tightening string causing picture to Jay to tip and spill cold water on top of Rube, waking him up from a sound sleep. But all that he does just to wake himself up. Here's the letters. An easy way to get dressed. Rube slides down railing. A, into pants and sne sneakers landing on bellows. B, which blasts off puff of air on the sleeping cat. C, startled cat leaps off scale lowering iron. D, onto air pump. E, planet Earth, beach ball. F, inflates, causing a pile of dirty, laundry, of dirty clothes. G, to slide in the laundry basket. H, which weighs down strings and pulls open pliers. I, allowing shirt to drop onto Rube. Rushing into the kitchen for breakfast, Rube passes through the doorway. J, quickly brushing his hair. So look what he does. Jumps into his pants and shoes. And all that happens. An excellent way to make breakfast. Rube jumps under the cutting board seesaw. A, lemon. B, catapults and turns on handheld vacuum. C, which sucks in dish towel and knocks over a bag of flour. D, which falls into the bicycle horn. E, loud honk, wakes hen. F, who suddenly lays several eggs. G, eggs roll down ramp, turn on veggie fill blender. H, before ending up in frying pan, smoothie splatters curtains. I, which gets heavier and pulls down curtain rod. Lowering helping hand. J, pushing down bread into toaster. K, when ready, toast pops up and slides down. Butter smeared sling chair. L, which launches two slices of perfectly buttered toast into the air for Rube to catch as he runs out the door. Kind of crazy there. Poor caterpillar. The surefire way to catch a school bus. Jumping on an exercise trampoline. A, Rube leaps out the front door, grabbing the zip line. B, his foot bumps a chair. C, knocking over the pitcher of orange juice. D, onto the barbecue grill. E, which, makes sm which smokes out hungry raccoon. F, who thinks it's time for hot dogs. The raccoon steps out of a tree onto the branch clippers. G, which cut a string, releasing a boot. H, that kicks yoga ball into the open bus doors. J, jamming them. This keeps the bus from moving while the impatient driver grumbles and Rube flings himself off the zip line and into the bus. Kind of funny, like the school bus driver's face. An awesome way to open a school locker. Late for class, Rube runs down the hallway and grabs a string, A, which yanks a hammer, B, into a piggy bank, C, smashes, smashes pig, releases coins, 
D, which rolled down chute and into gumball machine. E, a stream of gumballs. F, pours into a bucket. G, as it gets heavier, a bucket pulls down string mechanism. H, lifting helping hand, which pulls up latch. J, and opens both the locker door and the cracker covered dictionary. K, at the same time, falling cracker. Excite the always hungry cafeteria bird. M, who swings forward to catch the snack, lifting her magnetic sneakers. N, until they attach to the metal door, swinging open the locker. That is a lot of work for just opening a locker, but it looks like he's having fun. A goof-proof way to sneak into class late. Rube opens a biology lab door, A, allowing hungry goat, B, to enter. As goat happily eats organic cashews, C, he bobs his head up and down until his horns pierce a hole in the sandbag, D. Set bags get lighter and lever E lowers broom. F releasing tippy shelf so that the crowbot croquet ball G falls off. This causes metal balls H to clack back and forth, knocking the science trophy I off the shelf under the trigger J for crossbow K. This shoots an arrow L into an inflated tire so that the slowly escaping air propels Rube into his biology class on a skateboard. An epic way to make a painting. Rube releases rope, A, dropping bucket of sand, B, onto the trash pedal. C, lid springs up open, hurling rubber duck, D, into mallet, which slams down the paint tube. F, large dollop of paint hits ceramic mug, G, causing it to fall and hit on switch. H, of a fan, I, spinning tube, J, connected to belt, K, turns mechanical lawnmower blades. L, allowing three brooms, M, to drag through paint trays. N, and onto canvas, creating an epic painting. A handy way to dunk a basketball. Rube positions his basketball dunker, A, in place and starts by tipping back his helmet. B, which causes a pail of golf balls. C, to spill into a twisty funnel. D, and lands upside down in a football helmet. E, golf balls way down helmet, spring bottom, tugging string. F, which pulls pin, G, releasing spring-loaded helping hand, H, which dunks basketball, I, easily into hoop, J. A sneaky way to get out of class early. Rube tugs the world map, A, on the table, toppling the alphabet block tower, B, which releases the planet pendulum, C, knocking a book, D, off the shelf, weighted book pulls on strings tied to power switch, E, Turning on a fan, F, which blows pirate ship wind. Experiment G into the lemonade water cooler spigot. H, this releases a steam of liquid into clarinet and I out its finger holes. Worried classroom rabbit, J, thinks it's raining and jumps for cover under umbrella. Tied to a broom, K, broom tips and umbrella prong moves to the clock hand. L, forward 15 minutes. Effortless way to play with a dog while practicing the piano. Rube plays piano pressing foot pedals, which pull strings, causing B, causing feather duster C to drag back and forth, sweeping flower D out of bowl. As bowl gets lighter, the scale E rises, pulling string and causing painting F to tilt down. Angled picture allows rubber ball G to roll down edge of frame onto shoot H and into pitcher. I, pitcher drops, pulling string which lifts hat J, revealing cheese, K to Bertha, L, Rube's Siberian cheese hound, Bertha's leash, M, pulls revolving hat stand as she chases her favorite snack, running in circles, creating a never-ending play session for both piano player and pet. A speedy way to get all of your homework done at the same time. As Rube turns the pages of a book, String A pulls down tree branch B, causing ripe apple C to fall from tree into soup ladle D. This makes clothes hanger E tilt down, pulling string F, which uncorks vinegar bottle G. Vinegar pours onto baking powder filled volcano H, completing Rube's science homework. Erupting volcano ejects molten fluid into bucket, which lower I, which lowers crank J, spinning electric potter's wheel with helping hands K, shape rotating clay until L, until Rube's homework for art class is finished.
a no-brainer way to avoid baby brother's flying food at dinner. Rube's baby brother, Walter, sits in a high chair, playing with his food. When Walter leans forward, his undershirt, A, pulls rope, which unties slip knotted curtain sash, B, allowing curring curtains to open, and drags across plate of peanuts, C, peanuts fall into basket, D, weighing it down, causing watering can, E, to tip, soaking hanging plant, F, water plant gets heavier and pulls down on rope attached to the wall switch, G, turning on the ceiling fan, H, rotating blades are connected to a string tied to a banana, I, which hits spring-loaded mechanism, J, opening an umbrella and shielding Rube from his baby brother's flying food. Kind of funny. A perfect way to put toothpaste on a toothbrush. Rube lifts faucet handle, A, loosening string, which tips measuring cup, B, Water spills out of cup onto dry bar of soap, C, making it slippery enough to slide down the angled shelf into a funnel, D, then into a bucket, E. Weight of soap makes the bucket drop, pulling down on a towel, which rotates rod, F, and moves gears, G, to turn on shower, H, filling the bathtub as water rises. Floats upward, pushing squeegee, J, lifting shelf. This causes book, K, to fall over, knocking bowling ball, L, off shelf, and onto toothpaste tube, M, which skirts out the perfect doll of paste onto Ruth Rube's toothbrush. Oh, this looks like a long one. Okay. A simple way to go to bed. Rube finishes his favorite book. As he closes it, a string A pulls open a dresser drawer B and pops out a jack-in-the-box C, which bumps into a shelf of origami paper balloons D. This causes padlock E to fall off the shelf and the string F to wind around the telescope eyepiece G, which rotates and extends, pushing the softball H down a track. Softball hits encyclopedia I and rolls onto bike helmet J. Weight of softball pulls down on mechanical chair level K, lever K, which raises C, string tied to back of chair L, pulls up wall switch M, turning off dresser light N. The string is also connected to bed O where it pulls levered arm P to attach break blankets, tucking Ruth in for the night. After an ordinary day in an ordinary street in an ordinary house, it's late at night in the Goldberg home. All is quiet. Rube is asleep. Shh. Now it's time to dream. His dreams are very interesting. And that is the end. That was a fun book. Boy, Rube Goldberg is sure a busy boy. So let's answer our riddle. What did the pencil say to the sharpener? Stop going around in circles and get to the point. Get it? Point. If your pencil has a point, it's sharp. Silly. I miss you. I love you. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye, boys and girls.